Okay, so Christy, I um, asked you at breakfast if you had looked around when you came in from the other hotel and you said no. So I I'm going to no. I'm going to have you walk out here and I want to get your reaction. Okay. Go ahead and look up. <laughs> Oh my god. Wow. It's incredible. It's absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> it's beautiful. So everyone yes. everyone tends to miss it because when you get here in the afternoon it's cloudy. And we're walking in this direction towards the hotel. Oh my gosh. It's just spectacular. I mean the Himalayas are so tall. They're unlike anything I've ever seen before. And I've been to Africa, I've seen the Andes, I've seen the Kilimanjaro, and I just think um, this mountain range is just spectacular. And we're off on the way up to Namche Bazaar. different types of animals out here. Why not just standardize on one one type of animal? Why are there donkeys? Why are there the zukus, right? Zopkias. Zopkias. It is uh, now because of the altitude and the natural diversity here. We have a lower land, it's really hot for the yaks. They cannot come down as, this, as far as here because it's really hot for them. They could only uh, function better uh, up at the altitude. And that's why they have a lot of a different variety of animals. So the donkeys don't typically carry loads all the way up to base camp? No, I think in fact they are they go just up to I don't know if they go to Namche or no. I think they go about one more camp from here. I don't think they will let the, the donkeys in the national park. Oh really? No. Okay. No one yaks them. <laughs> There's so many people on this bridge. The heat is sapping all of my energy. <laughs> so I look forward to being above Namche uh, today where it's cooler, but we've made it to the Sagamartha Park entrance. So we're gonna get our permits, and that was gonna go in and handle that administration fee. We're gonna take a little bit of a break here, and then we should have lunch. <laughs> so much fun to cross and they're beautiful but you can't get from video is the smell of the pine trees 
so rich right now. It just smells lovely. So it's always, oh, like, there's so much more to this experience. You have to come out here and uh, experience it yourself. This is one of my favorite parts of this day. Okay. I think it's so pretty. This, this place? Yeah, this part right here. Okay. And then you get up near the end and you can see the bridge. Bridges, yeah. <laughs> well, bridges, yeah. <laughs> two there. The two, the old one and the new one. The new one's old yeah. now. <laughs> I, I have also had some really nice oh, conversations oh, wow. with friends along this part. This part? Because we haven't, once we get to the hill, we stop talking. <laughs> So we're just finishing the big hill, which I didn't get a lot of footage of because it just would have been me panting. <laughs> but come up to the rest stop real here, right here, and we'll see if we can meet the rest of our group. I know, I know. Oh, how Hi. are you guys? We're great. How are you? Good. I'm tired. Enjoy it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing well. Right. I got some great, wow. I bet. great so shots. For you. Think we'll be able to see? Sorry? Think we'll be able to see Everest or is it too cloudy? Yeah, we're trying to see Everest. What? It's everywhere. Yeah, we're trying to see Everest from here. Yeah, it's, it's too cloudy. cloudy. Yeah. yeah. Everest is everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Mountain to see. Oh, it's yeah. Just that's that just really, that's a much easier. It's a lot easier. Yeah. And then we took it one step further. <laughs> there's round Everest, there's slopey, I like slopey Everest, pokey Everest, pointy snowy Everest. Everest. Pointy Everest. <laughs> pointy Everest. Did your drone see us? Across sure. The <laughs> yeah, there's many Everests and there's many you. Almost numbed you. Yep, almost there. Almost to the bottom. Almost to the bottom, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And this year we have to go through the main city because they build a lot of uh, uh, special sites, like an entrance to the town of Namche, and there's a big money walls and prayer walls, and also a uh, in there. So it'll be totally different. Totally different. A different view. Three wheels that are functioned by water. What? Yeah. Three wheels, they are functioning with one. Oh, okay, yeah, so yeah. like in Bhutan. Yeah, yeah. That'd be cool. <laughs> like a tiger's yeah. nest. Yeah, yeah. The view from the lodge today. 
the next two nights is just wonderful. Where is the hotel from where we're standing? It's up over here near the top. Okay. Kind of in the if the ho if the Namche is a horseshoe and the top of the horseshoe is noon, it's like at two o'clock. Yes. <laughs> So do we have to go back to get to climb back up there? We will go walk through the city. Okay. Yeah. Great. They're aficionado. <laughs> and uh, having flashbacks to the Machu Picchu. Our hotel bus is up there, under the middle of the tower, with the radio. Let's go make a kind of a half-second here. Okay. Bypass. Yeah. Bypass. Yeah. Bypass. Yeah. Bypass.
top of Namche. And uh, now we get to go into the most wonderful lodge, the Panorama. Everyone's waiting for me so I can film it. This place is wonderful. Namaste. Namaste. <laughs> 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 Well, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Uh, that was filmed in the fall of 2019, so here we are back in 2020. We're back at the Himalayan Bistro in Fort Collins, and um, Dawa, I wanted to say that we met a woman very briefly at the end of that video. And we don't ex I don't explain who she is, but she's the proprietor of the Panorama Lodge. Who is she to you? She's um, a very special person to me um, because um, ever since 1998, I've been in the Kumbu. We always spend a day or two at our uh, lodge, Panorama Namche. So um, after spending um, uh, many seasons at her um, lodge, she almost became a family to me, almost uh, my um, great auntie. And um, every, um, since 1998, um, every time we go up in Kumbu, you know, we always get excited to go up to Panorama because uh, it's really beautiful um, uh, lodge and also um, she's a wonderful person and uh, really great food and you know, hospitality there. Yeah. yeah, it really is wonderful. I talk about it a lot on the, yeah. <laughs> on the way up there, but I can see how excited you are as we're walking into the lodge, yeah, how excited yeah. you are to be there. Yeah, it gets really, really excited, you know. I get really excited to be there. Yeah. Another thing that I really like about going out to the Himalayas with Dawa is that, and we saw it in this, in this episode in Namche as we're walking up, you're always shaking hands with people. You're always seeing people that you know. And um, it doesn't just necessarily mean like in one of the towns. It could be completely just on the trail you're going to run across someone. Does, do you find that always happens? Yeah, because it is um, really um, uh, a small community to me. It's almost um, we have uh, some connection through um, other guiding companies or, uh, you know, uh, related uh, uh, extended families and also a lot of friends, you know, and, uh, we see every time we go up there, we, we meet them, you know, it's really wonderful part of the um, adventure. So we go back and get connected to them and you know, see them throughout the uh, every season. Yeah. That's, that's awesome. It's always a pleasure to be out there with you. Um, so next episode, we are going to have a little bit of a rest in Namche, but most of the episode is going to be us hiking up to the Everest View Hotel um, and then descending down into Kumjung. And um, what mountain are we going to be seeing all the time from this point in the trek out? It's a beautiful mountain. What's it called? The uh, most beautiful um, Dablam. Yeah, it's mountain. Sea dominates the whole region for the next few days. And it, it's gorgeous. <laughs> so, and of course, we'll start to be able to see Everest. So, thanks so much for watching. I uh, really appreciate your hospitality, Dawa, and having me back in the bistro here. Um, if uh, you enjoy these episodes, please subscribe so that you don't miss any of them. Um, I'm figuring I've got a, a handful of episodes for this limited series, and I'm really enjoying uh, putting this out there. And always remember, you can scroll around and look in any direction you want during the 360 video. So thanks so much, Dawa. 
And thank you, uh, thank thanks you. for watching. Yeah. And um, yeah, we'll have the next episode out shortly. Bye.